Andrew Hamilton School is a K-8 school in West Philadelphia. The school is in a food desert. When we first spoke with the principal, one of his major priorities for the design was to have the green stormwater infrastructure function as a food producing space in order to provide equitable access to fresh, healthy food to both the students and the surrounding community. My vision is that we can create a place where our kids can learn about fresh vegetables and fruits and be able to see them grown in their neighborhood and their community and then be able to help like deliver them and give access to the, the neighborhood and the school community as a whole with uh, the access to having those fresh fruits at the, right there in the neighborhood at our school. Currently, Andrew Hamilton School pays over $1,000 a month in stormwater fees. Our project's design will manage the first one and a half inches of stormwater per given storm event, which will decrease this fee by 80%. This will provide significant cost savings to the school district. Andrew Hamilton School is a partner of the University of Pennsylvania's Netter Center. Penn's been working a little bit with Hamilton since 2002, I believe, so this just takes it to the next level, so we're so excited to do that. Andrew Hamilton School is in a combined sewer service area. This means that when it rains, stormwater runoff from the school combines with raw sewage into one pipe. During large storms, that pipe overflows and discharges that raw sewage mixture directly into the nearby Cobbs Creek. The outfall for that combined sewer overflow is just upstream of the predominantly African-American community of Eastwick, which already experiences chronic issues with both flooding and pollution. Any water which we can manage on the school's campus is water which won't add to Eastwick's existing environmental justice issues. We will accomplish these goals by creating a design which incorporates a green roof, several rain gardens, a disconnection of the faculty parking lot to irrigate one of the rain gardens. As the team desired to treat the polluted runoff prior to the proposed rain garden to prevent soil clogging and aesthetic reasons, a channel drain captures the sheet film and directs the discharge to an oil water separator that discharges to the rain garden. We will incorporate edible native species into all green areas of the design. Working with the students at Andrew Hamilton Elementary has been such a great experience. When we started talking to them about what grew in Pennsylvania versus what had to be transported from across the country, they really started to think about what it meant to grow and provide their own food for their community. They started thinking that they wanted things like watermelon and apples, but also even the assistant principal thought about growing peppers and how great that would be right on the school site. 